So I missed you so much. I know that everybody watching missed you and you're yeah. back. And I know so you've happy to be back. had a rough two weeks. Yeah, it was, um, I feel like life is one way on a Monday <laughs> and we all have our Mondays and we complain about them and we're like, oh, what a crummy Monday. And then like Tuesday rolls around and something really hits hard and you realize that Monday was actually pretty awesome. So for us, it was, you know, a little hope uh, had to go to the hospital and she was in the ICU for a few days and then the hospital for another week. And it was really scary. Um, and she's vibrant and brilliant. She's home. She's home. Yes. She's home. I'm, I'm over the moon that she's home. And I can't believe how amazing people are. Like, that's the thing I learned through all this. You know, like, the nurses who stood by her all the way, the nurses who checked on her constantly, the doctors who came in, the people who took care of us. And I felt like we were held. And, you know, it's funny. I always talk about gratitude, gratitude, but I found myself not living in that lane because I was scared. Yeah. And then I decided, you know what? Let me think about this for a minute. I have a family who loves me. I have a little girl who's home. I have a wonderful support system. I have doctors who would have done anything to make everything better, and they did. So sometimes you talk about gratitude, and then when you're pushed to the limit, you're like, do I feel it? And I'm wearing this little thing that a friend of mine sent to me. And she said, I'm going to take it off my neck and I'm going to send it to you. And it's worn down because I rub it all the time. And it says, God's got this. So she said, if I ever see you not wearing it, I'm coming <laughs> to get you. But that's it. That's it. So anyway, hope is home and good. So. Well, and she's got the strongest mama mm. in the world. And I was thinking, <laughs> you named her Hope. I did. You named I her did. Hope for a reason. And by the way, Hope is everywhere. Now, once you say her name, like every time, everything I look on every card, Hope always says, is that me? Is that me? And, and the other day, she was just, you know, she just got up from bed and she was so sweet and cute. And she wasn't feeling great. And she had in her hand two little confetti stars. And I looked at her because I'd just gotten out of the shower. And I turned and she was sitting there. And she said, I got two, Mom. And I said, oh, my gosh. She goes, one for me and one for you. And I thought to myself, this child, even when she's not feeling good, she's still giving everything away. So mm -hmm. anyway, I feel blessed and, and grateful. Really, really, really grateful. And also, anyone who's ever gone through an illness with a child, boy, yeah, yeah. I thought I understood you, but I don't. I didn't until you're sitting in that position. So for every single person who's going through some stuff, I, I get it. Yeah, well, you're yeah. here with us, and <sighs> we're so happy, and we also know that a lot of your heart is there oh, where yeah. it should be. But yeah. we are I'm uh, happy proud to... <laughs> of your bravery in every every well, single thing. I'm happy to be here, and I want to say thank you for everybody who was reaching out and stuff. I felt you. I heard you. I needed you. You know, sometimes you just say in a quiet thank you inside. So, I mean, do thank you know you. how many people... <laughs> I, I was in Texas. It's, where is Hoda now? Hoda. <laughs> My mom's like, where is Hoda? I'm like, oh, it's oh. going to be okay. Well, can I say thank you to Willie? Willie's the bomb, man. Mm -hmm. Everybody loves Willie, including me. So a big, big thank you to Willie and everybody else, Chanel, who filled Chanel, in. They yeah. love Chanel. Yeah, we love, love Willie. Chanel. We're we so lucky Willie. that we live, I mean, we work in a place like this. We basically live here, too. We do live we here. Live here.